Hello, everybody, and welcome back to another Second Wind launch day stream. My name is Nick Linder, the editor in chief of The Escapist, joined by Frost. And today we're going to be pirates in Skull oh, and Bones. Oh, we get to be pirate boats. Yeah, we, we get are. to be pirate boats in Skull and Bones, the game that's been in development for 11 years, and Ubisoft is touting as a quadruple A game, which really means nothing other than they spent a lot of money on making this thing because it took so long to make. No. 11 years. No, it, it's it, been that long. Oh, my goodness. It has goodness. been a long fucking time. Oh, okay. Well, this is what money gets you. <laughs> God. All right. So uh, this is essentially a live service control a boat and shoot things game. I uh, have played enough to at least get my boat with cannons on it, but we are going to work on getting a bigger ship on this stream. Frost is also playing, so we will be uh, we're trying to play co-op here in a second. Yep, yep. I still can't invite you to the group, so I guess I gotta leave yeah, the atolls to do that. Yeah, I'm right there. The way to St. Anne's marked on my compass, I'm there. And, uh, yeah, so, I, yeah, I mean, a lot of people wanted Skull and Bones to be, um, you know, another Assassin's Creed Black Flag. Uh, I would have liked that too, uh, but essentially, the way I'm looking at this game now is this is a, you know, a, a Everspace or whatever type game where you are contained to your ship your ship is your toy could be a car game same kind of concept uh so if you were looking for like an actual pirate simulation this is not that but i did send you a game for us yesterday that just came yeah. out in steam early access what or no actually it's at full release what was that game called uh let me check right here real quick here something caribbean I do recall that you sent me that i'm gonna say uh, Caribbean Legend. Yeah, Caribbean oh, yeah. Legend, which looks like a very janky uh, pirate game, but if you're looking for a pirate sim, <laughs> we, we may be checking that out soon. Is it time for pirates, you think? Th that was my first question where I go, oh, it's been in development for 10 years because it just hasn't been the age of pirates yet. You know, gladiators, zombies, No, I think it's ninjas. just... Well, the game, mm. the game was originally revealed as... A like four v four multiplayer pirate like shoot 'em up game. It, okay. was, it was really just multi like competitive multiplayer game, and oh. then people like didn't really react to that super well, and so it went through a development cycle of basically trying to be a single player pirate game, and then and then it got transitioned I think into a live service game. Oh man! So I think I do think this game has gone through like four different iterations of, you know, whatever we're trying to make, whatever it is now. Um, they already have released a roadmap, so there's already four seasons planned. There's going to be new sea monsters, you know, new events, new like legendary ships to go after, new locations. Um, in the no later, way. in the la in the later two. Uh, expansions that they have listed out they it, um, know that there's major gameplay features coming so with the amount of people that want there to be like more stuff to do on land and more stuff to do like the actual boarding ships and fighting Assassin's Creed style I imagine that stuff's going to come later down the line can you do that though Oh sure. Like I don't know how game development works. Like, can you just pop open the hood and be like, "All right, little land action here, a little melee combat"? Is that possible? Um, <laughs> a sprint function? I I mean, I, I, games have gone through radical transformations before, so why not? <laughs> oh, I just don't know like what a what an engine's capable of. Well, this is built on the Assassin's Creed engine. Eh. Okay. So like. Half of it. Are, yeah, are there sea shanties? Have you gotten a sea shanty? There, are, there are sea shanties, yes. Yeah. Am I going towards an objective? Yes. Wait. No, I literally went the wrong way. Why did I do that? Um, I was reading oh, no. chat and all that stuff. Uh, we got a couple super chats in. Ah, I donated $2 as Frost with the Elite Cosplay and SVS Guru. Done this five euros as Nick called himself editor at the escape is again. Can't escape it. It's at it's a reflex. I did it for five years. Give me a year. Give me a year. Give me, give me another five here. <laughs> the winds of fate. Right. But Silent you know, this, protagonist. Uh, yeah. This game definitely has like a lot of the same complaints I had over Suicide Squad where, you know, there is a single player campaign in this, but there is no 
mission design. <laughs> sure, sure, sure. Oh, so, no. I don't. Yeah, I don't know. I guess. I, the, again, this is this is absolutely going to be one of those games that has definitely has an audience that likes to just turn their brain off, sail the sea, shoot some stuff, do some missions every once, every, you know, every day for a couple hours, and then log off. So you say that, but it's hitting a weird audience here where it's sort of like, okay, I want to play like a an MMO where I'm a pirate. Sure, I get that. But then there's mm -hmm. also like the I want to man the ship. It feels like it's very light on manning the ship. It it, it was not it is not hardcore accurate as the anal retentative uh, crowd likes. It generally just feels like when it's time to aim the cannons, it just feels like a shooter. You're just like pew pew. Did pew, you know pew, you can pew, go in like, first person view? No. You know, How? While you're on your ship, click down on the D-pad. Oh my god. And then you can hear the you're on a controller. Of this guy. Why, why, why would you not play this game with a controller? I try them both usually. <laughs> uh, deliver the letter and report to Skeeter. Excuse me. Uh, let me know. Him. Let me know if the uh, audio is too low, chat, and I can raise the game volume up a little bit more. And this is seventy dollars. That's quadruple yeah, action for you right here. I, uh, yeah, I don't know if I would have priced this at seventy dollars. The reason I'm so chipper is because it's free. That's true. <laughs> it's a perk. <laughs> it is a perk of being a games media person. Is uh, we get to try these games for free and don't have to really make an investment in it. <laughs> yeah. So had I paid seventy bucks, I'd either be fuming or I'd be like, "This is the greatest game ever," and it will be the greatest game ever until I feel I got seventy bucks worth back. Yes, some people wanted the audio up. Uh, yes, and as a reminder, the uh, second one is completely funded by you on Patreon, YouTube memberships, and all that good stuff. Uh, we, we are seeing our first little dip on Patreon, finally. Uh, we'd like to get out of that dip, so if you would, are considering supporting us, now would be a great time to do so. Build your fleet with the help of St. Anne's pirate community. I don't trust any of you people. All right. All right, let's do some shipping. Step to the ship right. Big yucky. Where'd he go? Uh, and as Frost, Frost was saying before the stream, this game actually plays a lot more like a shooter than you would, have, you would think. Yeah, yeah, no, it, it, like in Sea of Thieves, it was very, you know, man, man the ship, man in the crow's nest, and man the man. This one is just very point, click, point. It reloads for you. You can just hold down the button, well, spam Black, it. Black Flag did that too. Yeah, but it still had a bit of like tactility to it, you know? Uh, this, this will too, t when you get uh, more cannons and stuff later on. Right. Do we have, is this like a deluxe edition or something? They gave us so much in the mail. Yes. We, okay. yeah, we, yeah, we, when you get a review code for this stuff, you always get like the the big edition. All right, cool, cool. Uh, you peasants can't keep up. Oh, what? This guy's wearing it too. <laughs> is, it IG, is that IGN? I'm actually, I'm in a, I'm in a storm, and it's actually kind of neat. Ouch, I took damage from that. Why are you shooting auto cannons? I don't know. And like, when you don't have a big ship and all you have is a spear, your guy is just like. Dum, 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 dum. Uh, googly ass, is there is there boarding? Uh, it, it's it, it's a cutscene. So like I said, a lot of the uh, a lot of the really cool stuff, like out of Black Flag and all that, where you could board a ship and fight for it, is not in, not in this. So if you are hoping for Black Flag 2.0, this is this is not it. This yeah, is, this expecting is War more... Thunder, but boat. Yeah, this is very much more a uh, car game. <laughs> car game? Why are you a car. car game? A car. Because yeah. it's like a car. you... Wait, car? No, I said car. You, okay. You upgrade your ship. You stay in your ship for a lot of it. You go on land to pick up missions. You know, that's kind of the extent of it. Sure, sure. Because I played the Cars game, like the, the Pixar movie once. You got to do crazier <laughs> things there. I... I you know, I'm, I'm curious how this game shapes up over a year. I mean, now that, now that it's out, they can get, you know, live player feedback, but, I mean, they've had a lot of betas and stuff, so... Uh, I feel like it's basically had to get the game out for shareholders and all this stuff. <laughs> Why are they going to play it? <laughs> nope. Is, it, is there sure a shareholder gonna, going, I really just want to play right now, man? Sure going to take their money, though. 
Like, that's what I'd do. If I was a shareholder, I don't care about getting my money back. Like, let me play it already. God. Got the materials. Acquire acacia. Like the wood. That's a good wood. Acquire a cog wheel. There we go. I got I got the cog wheel. Now I gotta get something else. Oh. Check him out to look at resources. What is with the bass sounds? I am loving low end feedback. What do you mean? Bass. The bass. Our bass got. I'm playing it's a not, I'm playing a fish, fish game. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Silly. Oops, I hit a player ship. Oh, now you <laughs> now you're gonna be in trouble. Big infamy for you. Oh. Nope. I got Sarah. There's only, there's only PV, PV, PvP if you go into like specific zones. Ah, uh, okay. Uh why did the cannon sound like the FBI knocking at your door? And then blue version with the two pound, more like black flag minus two. Oh negative one black flag. <laughs> I mean, yeah, I do have, uh, I, the, the cannons do sound a little weird, but I also have, like, I mean, I have the very basic cannons, so maybe they sound cool a little later. Also, whoever said to look up a game called Caribbean Legends, I just did, and that one looks cartoony, too. It's a little rough on the eyes, but it's kind of the trade-off for those, like, really immersive, depth-filled games. I don't, I don't so, you know, the graphics are weird. Buzz sound is. Hold on. Electric buzz? Is that your phone again? I don't think so. There's nothing. My phone's way over here now. You shouldn't hear it anymore if you did before. Oh, there's a lane because the game doesn't pause. I'm about to crash. That's right. <laughs> no pause. 70 bucks. You can't even pause. Well, if I paid uh, 70 bucks, you should allow me to pause online play. Is the buzzing gone? No, we'll oh, no. Leaving safe zone. I My mean, ship is no longer protected. What? I'm gonna get griefed right outside the starting zone. No, there's no. There's only PVP in like specific zones. You can't just go around shooting oh, everybody's okay. ship. I kind of wish you well, could, but yeah. Well, it won't last long. Oh yes, and the in the mini games for collecting stuff is is that which is dumb. But <laughs> it is what it is. I don't know. I guess I'd rather do that than have to get off the ship and go smack a tree. <laughs> the buzzing only happens during cannon fire. What? Does That's it, funny. Is it really? Apparently. <laughs> Weird. <laughs> what have you done? Uh, why do I always pick the furthest location? Uh, I'll adjust my sound know. settings when I get in here. Let's see. Settings, audio. How is my boat out of stamina? You're kidding me. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Mm -hmm. Well, yeah. I don't. Let's try. It. Let's try that with the headphones. See if that solves it. Uh, so yeah, if you're wondering what the mission design is like, this is kind of it. You collect contracts, you go do contracts, and then Destiny style, you come back and turn it in for people, and you get loot and stuff like that. And I am not going to listen to any of the dialogues. It's really bad. I don't care about it at all. Story, don't it care. Is, it is very, like, 2008 MMO dialogue, isn't it? We, and even lets you be like, you know, oh, I'll be nice about her. Like, I'm the rootinest, tootinest pirate <laughs> around here. Argy Hall. Alright, I'm here for some wood, ma'am. Uh, so you haven't, you haven't gotten your sh ship yet that has cannons, yes? Nope. Uh, I'm getting wood. Okay. So you're I was lied to. to. Okay. Yeah, you were lied to. Well, you lied to yourself. Lied to, dude. I'm trying to get wood. Where is it? Fuck, I went the wrong way. Your clothes are beginning to fit your 
Look at that. They give you all these beautiful islands. Can't even go on them. Uh, oh, what's that? I have to equip different things because I already geared myself up. Who's this guy? I'm already looking cool. Who's this map. freak? Huh. There we go. Ahoy! Disembark. I am now pirate with new hat. Are you kidding me? Is there a very specific place I have to park at? <laughs> <laughs> Wait, Where do I park? Yeah. No, you just when you get into the zone, it says disembark, and you hold the button, and you disembark. It don't. It doesn't though. I'm like on land trying to disembark, and it won't go. <laughs> what do you mean? You get back oh, on your like, ship? To no, yeah, to get off the ship onto the land. Yeah, you just hold the that, button. It won't do it. Oh well. Imagine the island has proper parking. See, I knew this wouldn't be a piratey pirate adventure when the first thing that come up was a. Like a, a TOS saying play fair. I was like, that's not very piratey. <laughs> right, on we go. Okay. All right, we go to the other place. I went the wrong way. More contracts. <laughs> Meet John Sircock. That's what I'm going to call him. Mm. Let's see. Look at that. What take, ten years take of dev time for this. It's, it's not old. You know, not old ten years of this. Uh, Working on this game must have been soul crushing. <laughs> Maybe. Maybe somebody was really happy and it's just like, yeah, this is a nice boat I made. Okay, so I can upgrade to a sentinel. Soon, I need bronze. I need certain planks. Oh, yeah. Okay, oh, yeah. So we're going to track that. Ooh. Uh, yeah. I can buy different fireworks for us. Well, what you going to do with them? I have a little party. A little 4th of July action. <laughs> uh. My dude is crashing into nothing. Y'all have asked. Ooh, a bounty board. Let's see who's on there. Level 5, I can handle that. Is that a real person or just a random thing? This is a random thing. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Gator yeah. T says Frost is part of his second win now. Frost has been part of second win since day one. What? I'm a co founder. What do you mean? <laughs> Yeah. I don't care, oh, I don't care about the story. I don't want anything to do with the story. Come on, man. Just read a little bit. Just, just a little no. Bit. I want to get on my ship and I want to shoot things. Okay. Uh, Plus, what if they read to you there? If other people are going to play this, no point in spoiling the story for them. But <laughs> There's no way they pull any crazy spoiler right at the start. <laughs> Uh, all right, that's that thing. All I want is wood. You gotta go chop your wood down. That's it. How? They won't let me get off? Whoa, Henry says, what story? Uh, there's a story. There's a single player yeah. campaign in this, but like I said, it's kind of like Suicide Squad where there's missions, but not really any mission design behind them. Hmm. Ah, there, there we go. go. Through here. That's a dolphin. That? Brokered ground tracking. I don't know. I don't know which symbol is to it. I'm a, let's just go to this one. There we go. Leaving safe zone. No, oh, no. There was a, there was a multiplayer game, kind of like, a little bit like chivalry, not chivalry. Uh, -huh. uh, uh man, I can't remember what it's called now. But it, uh, 
fuck, I'm trying to think of like some of the games that would be similar. I guess like kind of like Mountain Blade, but it was on both. Mm. It was popular for a little bit, and then it died. Oh my god. You don't go on land to chop wood. You play a mini game. <laughs> well, like I said, I'd, honest to God, I'd almost, I almost prefer that for this type of game than having to get off my ship every time to go chop sure, a tree. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If, if I want to do that, I'll go play it. Valheim. <laughs> sure. But I'm here like, you know what? If As far as like in the past two years, the games that I've played that let you be a boat and have little tiny mini games, Dredge is kind of <laughs> trying to... Kind of got the, the, the king right now. I got the crown. But uh, I will give you every chance possible, Skull and Bones. <laughs> Quadruple somebody, A goodness. <laughs> I just saw somebody say on Twitter that wind does not affect your ship, but it clearly does. Oh, yeah, yeah. You just, can't, like, you just oh. can't change your sail length. Yeah, no, you can't do, turn like, it. What? That's dumb. Why can't you change your sail to catch the wind? <laughs> That's Why is there stamina? <laughs> Yeah, that I don't get. Why Why do I got boat stamina? <laughs> uh, I love games. I love video games. The most immersive media known to man. There you go. Oh, I think I just like, crashed into the pirate's boat. Hmm. Boat gets tired a little bit. Nope, you can't change the direction of your sail. I think your crew does it. is supposed to do it for you. I mean, my, yeah, my, yeah, yeah. it's clearly changing. You saw it right there to catch the wind. I do like sailing in first person view, though. Oh, yeah. A bit more immersive that way. Your boat has stamina, so you can upgrade your stamina. I feel it. Like it's giving me all these things that I'm going to have to improve. <laughs> nice little load screen to get off the boat. Oh, yeah, baby. Coming through, coming through. All right, I found a new outpost. Well, at least I can sprint now. That's good. That's an improvement. Yeah, what? All right. Where's the ship right? Oh, Man, he's on the other side. I have to do a con contextual action to use a rope. Come on, developers. Whoa. Hey, what do you mean? Contextual? Like, well, like, I'm, I'm on like, an outpost <laughs> land, but, like, yeah, I can't, like, just jump off. I have to use a stupid rope. <laughs> Yeah. I see Fudge. and its reward. Of course, we carry rogues like you often favor the sea. If you are here as an instrument of their treachery, but if you prove true to your words, then we might have something more. What? I swear to God. Ooh. Oh, that's the carpenter. Jesus Christ. I almost gave him what I wanted. <laughs> Don't do that. What is this? Josh Nellis with the $2 play One Piece Pirate Warriors 4. More piratey? Yeah. I should have pirated this game to complete the... Uh, just the circle of piratey. I don't know. I can't climb the rope back up. Okay. Here we go. Is who you want me to find to you? Good day. Uh, what objective am I at? I'm at an objective here, but I can't. There's like no icon. A weird UI. Okay, so where am I? Alrighty. Broke Craft the ground. Craft a B the rammer at the ship, right? Okay. Well, these are all the same icon. Oh, can I buy the material here? Is that what it's trying to tell me? <laughs> I love that you can make a whole ass boat with just 14 wood. <laughs> <laughs> yes, 14 wood and you have a boat. No, yeah, 14 wood, <laughs> I gotta hook you up. <laughs> love it. Mm -hmm. Okay, so you don't have what I need. And where did it send me up here? Oh, nice little oh, boat building cutscene. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, a little firework, too. This is so funny. <laughs> hmm. 
sea people. Okay, I found sea people. What? Alrighty. Thank you, Captain. Hunting requires precision. <laughs> what? Okay. Well, uh, blue ooh, well, I can buy a blueprint. Yeah, the setup right now is hella MMO of like yeah, all right, it's, talk, it's very talk MMO. to the guy to learn how to craft and then talk to this guy so you can learn how to get your weapons and then yeah. Yep, very destiny. Uh, oh, is that how they do okay. Have you not played Destiny? I, I do, and I, I don't know why, because I just keep pressing, like, continue or whatever, and I'm always in a different <laughs> spot. Like, yeah. Uh, somebody was mad at me for saying Destiny yeah. was, like, the uh, uh, the grandfather or whatever of all this, this like, current, you know, live service model. You thinking? Hmm. Uh, well, yeah, I mean, like, every, every one of their games is, every game that does this, like, can be traced back to Destiny and using the same ui same everything uh i guess i guess it's mmo uh, design like i, I get i have yeah, world yeah, of warcraft but at least warcraft yeah. world of warcraft missions are interesting yeah always it's like i feel like borderlands and destiny were the ones that made it so it's like okay you know what it's okay if shooters do this too even though it was just mostly mmos i, I really yeah, don't man. know if i i guess i did something there <laughs> i don't know what i did yeah, she's lacking a bit of feedback. That's what I'm feeling right now. She this game, she lacks a bit of feedback. Well, like I, I'm doing a mission to get supply crates, and all I did was accept the contract, and then I guess it gave it to me, <laughs> but it didn't mm -hmm. didn't tell me that it did or I missed it. If I was looking mm -hmm. at chat or something. We never talked. <laughs> <laughs> Me own blacksmith. <laughs> all right. Say I gotta craft another cannon thing. Oh, don't crash Henry, on me. Henry says, for fuck's sake, can you just play Black Flag or Odyssey? It looks like Chad is unanimous in this one. No. We're checking out Oi. Skull and Bones. You don't like it? Listen. You don't have to watch it. <laughs> Listen, children, all right? You can't always eat sugar. The whole reason <laughs> yeah. that we, we do so well is because we put our bodies through this. This, is, this shows you right now, not everyone can be a critic. Yes. If you can't swallow this gameplay for 40 hours, you ain't gonna do it. You ain't gonna cut it out. I, I, I work I construction. I this is uh, nothing. I should have put that in my my column that I wrote. If you can, uh, if you can't put yourself in front of games that you might not enjoy, you cannot be a critic. <laughs> oh yeah, like easily eighty percent of the time is playing just stuff you're not well, that interested. Not, not not garbage per se. Recycling, yeah. uh, you know, and uh, yeah, no, I mean, that, is, that is part of the job. A lot a lot of it. It is ten percent. You get to play that game that you absolutely want to, and you got it for free, and you get to do a sixty-hour piece on it. But the rest of that time, it's just yeah, yeah no, like trying. I don't know. I'm that. legitimately curious about this game. Like it's been in development so so long. Like that's the fun part about being a critic is curiosity. Why is there a loading screen for the crap for the store? There's <laughs> like, a loading what, screen for what are you loading? Crust. Yeah. <laughs> There's a loading screen. Oh yeah, there's no goodness, doors yeah. to places. You have to use a loading screen to get in. Oh, I cry every time. When angels deserve to. Boom! <laughs> oh shit! Uh, I, I fucked up. Oh no, my land. SVS uh, with the five year old. The food industry puts sugar in everything, so yes, you can't always eat sugar. They put corn syrup in everything, so it's not necessarily always sugar. <laughs> The sugar, yes, but like not necessarily that high quality stuff you want. Important bet, question: You're having fun. Uh, it's always fun to stream. I bet everybody watching this now is appreciating Sea of Thieves a hell of a lot more. <laughs> Honestly, though. Ah, One thousand cannonballs. Wait. Balls. Am I doing anything? What's going on here? Ooh, people are fighting. Hmm. High quality sugar? No, it's not. It's not a reference to cocaine at all. <laughs> I 
Don't go drowning in a mud puddle. I like the blacksmith. He's fun. Bla I think blacksmiths in any game, they just kind of have the best of them. Uh, ah, with the $2 frost, Nick, can you sing a shanty for us? Uh, say I to the window, to the wall, <laughs> my to the sweat drop, <laughs> drop down shore. <laughs> Ow, who's shooting me? Oh, it's a, this thing. Okay, come try. I need more cannons. Uh, I need a bigger ship for us. For something sail. Side it is the looter shooter the boat. Ow, who's shooting me? Everybody's me. shooting. Me. Oh, my ship blew up. This one that, 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 that one guy, he's on fire, but he's alive. Oh, now he's dead. He's sunk. Budge. Ah. Manage ship to equip your load out. Yeah, yeah, apparently there's a... Oh, have you got to pay money to respawn at sea? Yeah, there's. A, I, it's a bug with the game, apparently, some of the art, audio artifacts. I don't know if other streams are doing it. So see if, so see if they're using it. Yeah, it's not in game, it's just a stream thing. Boom. Alright, alright. Three cannons. Shabuya. Furniture? Oh, I've got a rope locker? Birk has an idea. Let's see. What's your idea? Hmm. He knows all. I believe in him. Don't forget to customize the look of your ship. Ah, oh, you should let me. Oh, well, if I. Well, it's okay. Hmm? Pfft, that looks groovy. <laughs> oh my god. My goodness. Well, I'm gonna use all this exclusive hey. gear to separate I, myself from I didn't the do peasants. Nothing. Why are you shooting me? Uh, oh shit, God, what happened? Up again. Oh no, Nick, I found the microtransactions. I'm, I'm stuck. Right, well, they're everywhere, yeah. <laughs> ah. Dear God. $70, and you can also pay six fifty nine ninety nine for a boatload of gold. Can you, can you send the frost? Eric, since I'm the one hosting the stream, I look. Er Eric's gonna send you an audio tip for me to do. Okay, he said. Um, oh, he said no. There it is. I okay. Need to go by, I need to go by fixing materials. Okay, so uh, go to sound settings, like on your PC, select your headphone audio, and disable, enable exclusive mode. Oh, that's cool. I didn't know it was a thing. Uh, okay. Let me, let me off this game. Let's go to sound settings. Yeah, I think so too, Caracon. Yeah, if this yeah, game was what, 30 what bucks, would be more patient. Um, your sound settings, headphone audio. And disable enable exclusive mode. Headphone audio. Where's that? Um, uh, okay. <laughs> disable exclusive? What? Yeah, so it's like ex exclusive mode. If I have no oh, idea. like on your headphone audio, right click properties, and then it should show up like. General levels enhancements advanced, and that's where exclusive mode is. Sound settings. Alrighty. Well, I can't pay for that. Unfortunate. Oh, baby, I've unlocked so many things. Uh, this gear doesn't look all that impressive. I'll be honest. Speakers, property. Oh, edit name. Okay, Your ship so, can have a name. Sorry, it, I found it now, and it wants me to turn. You wants me to turn those off. Yeah. Okay, that is turned off. Let's see if that fixes it. Won't know until I go shoot at something again. Hi, sea person, merchant. You stand there at all hours of the day. You never move. Oh my god, that's that's it? Okay. 
well, whatever. That's a uh, weapon blueprint. Long barrel cannons. Yes, please. Well, okay. First aid station. a modest amount of the ship's hull, okay. Uh-huh. Okay. <laughs> I didn't see the ship name. <laughs> I forgot. I forgot I named it that. This is a bad ship port. You got a giant rock right in the middle that I'm gonna hit. Oh, no. Okay, so now one more, one more menu item I gotta go do. <laughs> but first, time to test out this audio fix. Let me know if it's fixed, chat. Now that I'm shooting cannons at somebody. Frost, are you muted? Okay, give me a sec. Oh, I forgot to fix that too. Okay, the cannons sound better and that's fixed. Now I just gotta go fix Discord now. Is that me? Yes, I hear you now. Yeah. All right, cool. Now, as I was saying, uh, I can <laughs> accept an invite, but I can't join you because you got some settings, apparently. Okay. I'll invite you as soon as I destroy this shit. All right, kill him and I'll be here. I mean, well, the ammo is not unlimited. So. Uh, yeah, no, it's not. That's about it. Mm -hmm. Ah, you hold space to brace. That's cute. That's funny. And to chat, ahoy, me hearties. Currently unavailable. Dang. There, I invited Band. you. There you are. Alright. Eric says Ooh. Buzz is back. Maybe it's tied to Discord? Possible. <laughs> okay. Let's try. Buzzing happens whenever you get hit. That's funny. Uh, overall thoughts so far. Uh, Thirty minutes in. It's uh. Can Eric, it can works. You, can you check somebody else streaming the game and see if it's a problem? I, mean, I don't really know. Try talking again for us. Ah, uh, um, okay. Toy okay. Story 5, Buzz is back. <laughs> You're on there. Sounds very similar to when you turn on Mike's 3.5 millimeter jack inside its socket. Uh, I might be picking something up and feeding it back. Ooh. I don't know. Let's try... Who the hell? Oh. No, that will... I'm setting it to mono. Target too far. Setting it to mono audio won't fix that, so... Let's just try... Doing... <laughs> let's try that. Oh, yeah, so yeah. Is that you out there? Target too far. Nope. Ben Spiv 16. Ah, that way. 
Uh, I, yeah, does it share our objectives or? Um, it should. Yeah, I see. I see you. I see an objective marker. You, you three uh, kilometers destroy away from me. Gather ships or something like that. No, I can't pick sound output, Eric. I know, like, it's not an option. I'm not in stamina. Boat it stamina. Might, it, I think, I think what might be hit, the game might be interacting poorly with Discord as like an audio bug. Huh. I wonder. It's like in-game comms or something. Can I hear us? I don't know. Who? The players. No, there's no props yet. No, oh, that's what it's really needing. That's the best Real part about Sea of, of Thieves. Yeah. Yeah, people, people keep fo you, you guys keep focusing on the quadruple A. It does not mean what you think it means. It's literally just the amount of money that went into the game, and a lot of money That's went exactly into the game because it was in development hell for a long time. So, yes, here Yves might be trying. The CEO of Ubisoft might be trying to like paint a picture with it, but I think everybody's taking that quadruple A thing and just. Running with it. I mean, it, the no, number of A's on anything has no indication of quality in a game ever. Mm. So, like, <laughs> you can make fun of it for being a quadruple A game, a triple A game. But it could just be a bad game, and that's it has nothing to do with the A's. Okay, I hear you, but the more money spent equals more expectations. No, the more money that's spent, your expectations is probably go lo lower. <laughs> yeah. Was it? It took that, that is to like, I guess, bare bones consumerism. But no, just because something's priced higher, yeah, doesn't mean it's gonna be any better. They're still charging me in the game for cosmetics. Man, eh, I guess that's fine. Is that you? I'm I'm sailing through like a canal. Uh, you're, okay. I'm, I'm the orange. I'm then. the orange icon on your map. On Let's your compass up top. There you are. Oh, there's the canal. I got you. Now, Nan Nam says the price tag does set expectations. I guess. No, not really, because it's never been written anywhere that's like the more it costs, the more, you know, like the gooder it is. That That is just basic yeah. manipulation. That's basic psychology. Yeah, I guess if your expectation of the game will be good because it costs a lot, it's a you problem. <laughs> Honestly. Yeah. In a nice way, you. you Probably unlearn that habit. <laughs> yeah. It'll serve you well in the long run. Is that a fort? Oh, it is. It's like a one piece fort. <laughs> yeah, yeah, plunder cutscene. That was fun. I had a lot What's of fun the current with that. Stuck in development hell meme game. Uh, what's that? Star game? What's Star it Citizen? There you go. But it's like the most expensive game right now. And it's not even real. Yet. <laughs> Yet. <laughs> yeah. You think they don't make it? You don't, you don't think they serve anything up? Uh, I'm pretty confident Squadron 42 coming out after the latest updates they did on it last year. Right. Showed a lot of stuff from it. Praise for impact. I think I joined a world event. I think I joined a plundering Sox. world event. Oh, they're good. What the hell? Hmm. Uh, SBS with the five euro. So how many A's out of the claim four does this game deserve? What are we talking like? Like eggs? I mean, if they spent a lot of money, I guess all of them? <laughs> I don't know. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's expensive. Do I? Oh, you're at the thrill of the hunt. Is that the thing you're trying to accomplish? I don't know. I just, I just, I just clicked. I held triangle and clicked blunder, and I'm in a battle. My captain is drunk. Oh, I've crashed my ship. Speaking of, can we destroy them all? Can I, can I land now? Oh, I forgot that was a thing. Oopsies. Are there more ships oh, coming? Da, 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 da. This is sort of, I guess, why there's like we tend to have a little bit of pushback whenever it comes to like hype, because yeah. hype 
can't be measured, but it's it's it tends to be measured depending on like one budget or like how long it's been. Just because it's been in the oven for so long doesn't mean it'll, it'll come out good. In fact, you leave it in the oven too long, it'll come out really dry and I hope it's jerky that you're making. There we go. I don't, I don't know what this event... I, there's like treasure chests opening up at the top. I guess we get loose for surviving or something. I don't casino know. Casino in? We had no hype for this game. Even that that too. Negative hype doesn't mean it'll be good too. <laughs> there, that, that's what I'm getting at is that there just is no correlation with any, any hype, any budget, any time spent on a game. In the end, it's just the final product. Yeah. Oh god, the French are screaming at me. 10 out of 10. Oh, um, what, See, yeah, it, it was, you know, we had our podcast last night where I talked about how uh, I was kind of enjoying Suicide Squad, even though, like, I know it's a bad game, clearly. I was watching Skill Up's review of Skull and Bones, and basically he had the same thing about this. He's like, it's a dumb, bad game. Kind of enjoyed it a little bit. <laughs> oh my goodness! I'm parking, I'm so lost. Hold on. Yeah, I think my, my main, like, I don't mind the sailing, I don't mind the ship combat, I, the mission design is dumb. Uh, I just wish the ships, like, had more destruction added to them and, vis like, more visual elements to make it feel like I'm hitting something. Sure, 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 sure. There's, like, a solid tank game with pirate ships. See, not really. You just feel like a floating mass. You don't, you don't really feel like a boat. Yeah, I mean, I guess we're, we're streaming this to see what it is, so, you know, I, yeah. <laughs> we're not trying to sell you on the game. We're, we're just playing playing it. That's the this is the, the, the journalistic process right here. About to run over this uh, random, see if it does anything. Come to Papa. Come here, come here, come here. Oh, my God. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Oh, no. That was a bad idea. Is it Skad's member for two months? Drink up me hearties, yo ho, poop deck, here we go. Oh no, not the poop deck. I'm being shot for being a bad driver. Which <laughs> should pro should happen in real life, but Okay, I'm going, I'm going. Oh no. I asked if you asked for the five year old, can you ram the enemy in a suicide attack like in World of Warships? Yes, yes you can. Yeah, you can yes. definitely ram into the enemy. Uh, but for the most part, you're shooting at critical points, which is a big explosive on their back and like their top flag for some reason. Like, I don't know why shooting at the crow's nest is a critical spot, but... Taking out their... Uh... Navigation, I guess. <laughs> and the warning that somebody's coming to kill you. Yeah, sure. I've just shot the captain's cousin. Morale all time low. Uh... No, not again. Gameplay looks bland and casual. Oh yeah, but you know casual. what? Our, uh, <laughs> there is an audience for this stuff. That's why they keep making them. That being said, dun, 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 uh, dun, I don't know if you dun, saw dun. Suicide Squad drop below 2,000 player active players on Steam yesterday. Eh. That's bad. Is it? I see. I feel like that game's audience is mostly console. Uh. It's still, it's, still, like, it's still an indication that like people are not sticking with it. Fair, fair. At all. Like to me, looter shooters are if they're not like that intense, they're the best. Like I'm on the couch, crack open the Xbox and a beer. You see, the problem with Suicide Squad is like it's a looter shooter, but there's no like incentive to go for the loot. <laughs> I hate that. Things no, just like, drop and you're numb. That feels like depression. Well, it's not even that. It's like just completing missions over and over again. Like you know, Destiny, you have to like do things to go get specific weapons and items. Right. Yeah, uh, old Hutu, dollar ninety nine. Sup, God Gamer Frost? While well, Lisfanga kicks my ass. Yeah, you like you like mm -hmm. playing a little little clone action there. Jacob Kitty says this squad is still in top, place top ten best selling games this week. It's successful. 
It's successful right now, it's a live service game that people need to stick with for them to continue developing it. And I don't think Hold it's going to have the staying power. I'm selling game. That is a garbage stat. Who else is selling yep. games right now? <laughs> the like, what? All the others have already sold. Of course you're in 10th now. Yeah, Grand Blue Fantasy Relink did a million. Yeah. Uh, it's like, oh, it, who was it? Three weeks after Pal World came out, they're like, oh, it's being, it now got trumped by this other game. I'm like, yeah, because everyone's bought it. Mm -hmm. The thing about statistics is like, what you interpret from the data is as important as the data. All right, you're over this way. Yeah, there's your ship shanties. On me. I'm of the mind, uh, whoever's paying 70 bucks for this thing on release is going to be happy with it. You think so? Same thing with Suicide Squad. Anyone, <clears throat> like, there's a, an audience that's just like, oh, I can't wait to play this game, and they save up their money, and, and then there you go. Yeah, the, problem, the problem is, though, they got to stick with it. That's the expectation of this, this game and Suicide Squad, is that you play it for a long time, and it's the only game you stick with for a while. Nah. Su sure. Well, that's why they've already announced there's a whole roadmap for Suicide Squad and this. They want oh, you to get invested well, into it at the launch date. Oh, that's that's just stupid. Nah, well, yeah. These are <laughs> that's not, the whole these problem. Are not, this is not worth a forever <laughs> they, game. Absolutely not. They, they, plan, they plan a whole year of content around these things, and then if they oh, don't great. take off at launch, they get canceled quickly. Nah. If that's true, then this one here, uh, dead in six months. We'll see. That's if there's one thing Ubisoft has proven to be good at, it is sticking with their live service games. Aside from like Hyperscape, and either like multi, like their smaller multiplayer ones, but Siege, For Honor, hell, even Assassin's Creed Valhalla, Division, those are all those are all healthy and got lots of updates. Mm. Oh dear God! Please no! Oh no no no! Stop 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 stop! Don't do it! Don't do it! Don't do it! Don't shoot me! Oh, I'm about to die! Oh, blew up! <laughs> All right, let's see what happens now. Yeah, my and my only see, problem with I'm people not, continuing I'm to bring sure. up Black Flag is that it was good at the time. I don't know if it's held up that well. Mm -hmm. oh. the, the ship combat has held up well. I don't know if the rest of the game has held up as well as people think it is. Oh, it was pretty. That's about it. Um, uh, well, it wasn't pretty. It played, it played good. I just think I think if you have played Odyssey or Origins or Valhalla and try to go back and play the combat of older Assassin's Creed games, like, as somebody that recently tried to play Rogue, and I just, I, it just has not aged great. Mm, yeah. 80s jacket, five dollars. For us, as someone who played full price for Kane and Lynch Dog Days on release, I respectfully disagree. A little, uh, a little buyer's remorse there for Kane and Lynch. <laughs> <laughs> Man, that reminds me of like Army of Two. The first game was good, and every game after that got progressively worse. Tragic. Where am I? Oh my God, I'm a scoundrel. Tragic. Uh, this is Onyxia, member for three months. Green Gang. They should. They could have just given us a sequel to Blood Wake, the uh, the Alan Wake Three. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. See, Cypher freak over on My, Twitch also used two hundred bits and said, "For us, you look freaking amazing." Is there going to be more cosplay of you and Will are playing wrestling tomorrow? Oh man, I should. I need to make my luchador fit, don't I? <laughs> I'll figure something out. Uh, 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 SBS with the five euro, they could add pop culture pirates and a gacha mechanic to try and keep it alive, like uh, Fortnite. My thing is, and Path of Exile has proven this a long time ago. Um, if you can calculate the minimum amount of players that you need, you can keep a game, well, a live service, if you will. You can you can keep it undead for a pretty good while. So I don't know how many they need for this kind of game. Dun 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 dun. Oh my god. Oh, that's a shot. Dear God. And Geo, thank you for the tip jar. Appreciate you. Fine. Jute and bronze. 
I have four, I need six, and I have five, and I need twelve. There you do go. Do you sell this stuff? I do not. Like, who, was it? who was it? It was um, <clears throat> Chris Wilson, Path of Exile. He said they calculated that Path of Exile just needed a minimum of 10,000 players concurrent. And then they were fine. So, depending on how many people they keep working on this game, they, they could be okay. They want my new ship. All right, so I need bronze and jute. Whatever the hell that is. My boat doesn't make these kind of turns, boyo. Oh. <laughs> Enough. We go slow. Oh, I found I found green wood. Green or grain? No, green as in like, you know, on looter shooters, I think it means it's uncommon. <laughs> oh, I need to go sell some of my cargo. I guess that's what you're supposed to do as a pirate, not hoard your stuff. You need to sell it. Damn. <laughs> oh. Welcome to Mako Lacey's provision shop. So, <laughs> character runs like a Welsh. <laughs> That's good. That's good. Sell my. I'm selling all the rum. I'm sorry, Jack Sparrow. No. Oh, is the rum always gone? Station. Oh, I can install it on my ship. Ain't any. Dear God. He wants me to. Sell my cargo, but I have. Oh wait, I got to I offload it. I forgot. Is there any on foot combat? No, it's all ship combat. Every every island is this. You walk around, you talk to merchants and item and menus, and that's it. Well, yeah, we don't know that. We do know that there is no on foot combat. We haven't tried every island yet. It's all there is. There's no mechanics. Well, what if that's like a late game island? You get to no. get off. Stretch your sea legs. There's no mechanics. I need money. No. I need food. I'm no mechanics. <laughs> Fungus with the two dollars. Greenwood smokes a lot. Let it cure for clean burn. Right. Oh, fungus knows wood. And fungus. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See, since it's, there's not much that you can do on land, you can pretend that you're Davy Jones. And you're just not allowed to go on <laughs> land for too long. Yes. Carry a bucket with you. Exactly what you can do. I can't. I, I'm excited to make my video on. Please get me the fuck out of menus. <laughs> okay, it's not that bad. I can't stand it, Frost. I can't stand being in menus for everything. Play, play like a Factorio or something like no. that. No. Yeah. This game could have used that's crackdown the, that's mechanics. The next genre my you ship, need my to. Ship, <laughs> I should just shoot things. My ship should gain XP and level up, and I don't have to go craft a new ship. It just suddenly a little ghosty pirate effect pops up, and then my ship is now a cruiser or whatever sure, they call sure. it. <laughs> I don't want to do menus. I don't want to be in menus for every single thing that I do in these games. That's why I'm so tired of live service games. Right, right, right. I mean, you're on the wrong system for that, but PC, it's all, we're all about that interface. No. There you go. Oh, yeah, this <laughs> cookie That's good stuff. You want less menus? I'd, I'd give you less menus. Mobile games. Uh, now, yeah, that's true. One. You, yeah, I am in less menus. You just gotta watch 30 second ads instead. Yeah. Yeah. But like, you know, what else were you doing? Next gen says menus are fine for me. I don't want to collect loot from menus. Let me go search for it on the sea. Uh -huh. Why can't I find a ship on the sea and just go get on it and then fix it up and then it's mine? Oh, shit, man. <laughs> oh. Treasure maps lead to buried treasure. Oh, cool. Yeah, this just kind of does feel like that it's open gonna, world. It's going to be Black a... Black flag's a bit watered down a little. <laughs> yeah, it's going to be a, a, a little game you do from your ship where you click the timer to <laughs> do the loot. Oh, fuck me. No, none of that. Avast, oh, yeah. I have found G. Uh, you two, oh. Hey. Ahoy. What do you need? These guys got, these got repair kits. All right. Yeah, what are we doing? I I'm found destroying G. these ships. These guys? All right. Oh, man. The reload on this thing is wicked. 
I don't use these repair kits by chance, or they're just for yeah, fun. No, it's the left on the D-pad or whatever. Oh no! Don't let him shoot me. Are you gonna blow up? Oh, oh, you should have repaired. Yes, uh, I need the repair kit. I can't find that button. <laughs> it's it's down to the bottom left. Ah! What is it on controller? Yeah. Deep no, left. Wait, what left on the deep end. Fuck. <laughs> he blew up. <laughs> uh, there goes my money. Fungus, five dollars. Conversely, green wood is better for growing mushrooms using a drill and little innocu eh, inoculated wooden dowels as fewer competing species have colonized. Nice. Uh, the we ship spawned. does have firing angles. You have to like switch, you know, switch camera size to use the cannons on each side of the ship. Uh, I have front facing cameras right now. You can upgrade the ship later on to get like mortars and all that kind of stuff. Rear cannons. Mm. There's a there's a lot of upgrades to do on the ships. So, like if you like that part of Black Flag, like that's all that's all. Here. Mm. Dun, dun, da, dun, 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 dun. All right. Uh, I'm back. Yeah, the, look, the ship the ship combat is, is actually not bad. And don't forget, like, this is early game, too. I'm not even in, like, a, a full-on battleship yet, either, so... You know, I can have full broadside cannons and all that. Ah! I found the button. Owie. <laughs> What we should do is get a real pirate and get their thoughts on these games. <laughs> like, I wouldn't know if this is what pirating was like back then. See, that's the problem with realism, is you gotta go for the fun. It's just fun to fun to fun to fun instead of like, yeah, this is exactly what it was like, being on a boat dicking around. My sails. Uh, James Morgan, dollar ninety nine. Oh, Maybe too early, but which is more fun, this or Sea of Thieves? <sighs> They're very different games. Yeah. If you want like guys. a real, like yeah, true sailing experience, where you know you have to manage the ship and do like you know change the sails and all that kind of stuff, Sea of Thieves. If you want a game where you just shoot shit. That this works. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Can't get scurvy on this. Huh? You should get this shit out. Yep. Well, watch yourself now. Okay. Fire away, go. Yeah, I know. I tried. Hey. Big old crit hit. But Do we nice. share loot when you pick it up? Uh, I got my own set. I don't know I about you. Set. Ah, client side. <laughs> yeah, just uh, I know it's funny to me. You've <laughs> there's other third-person shooters to compete with right now. Yeah, um, we need to find. It's a French word. Campaign, campaign merchant ships, <laughs> All right. which are there's a supply route over okay. to our left. Yeah, those ships. Is this, uh, you can use your uh, you can use your telescope to see what those uh, ships are. Is this the world's first quadruple A game? Oh my god! Is it? No. Has no one else used that term? Call of Duty would be a quadruple A game. With how much they spend, or? Yeah, Warzone's a quadruple A game. Okay. Right. Thank you, Matthew. No, yeah. for us, I am, or Eric, I'm not hearing the buzz. Uh, let's see where's the, I, I didn't, right. I didn't consent to that. Set it on Eric. All right, th these blue and yellow ships, the French ships. Oh. I'm gonna take these out. Yeah, they're actually marked too. That's like, it's our objective almost. Bink. I missed. I swoop in right in the red. Wow, I actually shot through the thing. Did nothing important. Maybe. Let 
You know what? Uh -huh. Playing playing this with a friend, now I can see the like even even just these few seconds that we played together, I can see the appeal a bit more. Everything's better with friends. <laughs> Ooh. Are we boarding? Crew boarding? I got him. I, I missed. <laughs> Damn. It's burning. I blew him up. Big wigs. Okay. It's it's this game's like in a weird spot for me because like Rainbow Six Siege at launch was not a great game, but yeah. you know if like Ubisoft commits to a live service game, they seem to know how to fix it. Because <laughs> I, I would wager to say I would wager to say like out of all the major publishers, EA, whatever, EA, Bethesda, uh, even Sony, like. Ubisoft, I think, has the most successful live service games in their lineup. Are you forgetting about Hardline or whatever it was called? Battlefield Hardline? Yeah. What about it? That was some poo poo, man. Yeah, it was. State poo poo, too. That, was, that yeah. wasn't Ubisoft, that was EA. <laughs> oh, yeah. Wait, was that not? <laughs> oh, I'm got that was confused. Battlefield Hardline, it's EA. <laughs> Tragic. People are bringing up Blizzard and Fortnite. Yes, I said a publisher. Uh, like those are developers. <laughs> I'm gonna get them. I'm gonna like get Ubi them. Ubisoft as a collective publisher, I think, has handled their live service games actually relatively well. The ones that they do end up supporting long term. I did it. <laughs> I got the boarding cutscene. Oh, you did. <laughs> yeah. I'll up now. You should do it so that they they can see. They saw the plundering uh, cutscene. Yeah. It wasn't much better. <laughs> Oh, I got grilled bread. Yeah, you know what? It was worse. You know, I'd rather just sink them and grab the loot than do that. <laughs> you get their, I think you get like the weapons or stuff that are on board if you actually do board them. Yeah. But then it makes you remember you're not playing Black Flag and makes you sad. Yeah. Again, this kind of hits that sort of like you know, incremental, well, like you said, card game. It's just kind of yeah. nice to see it improve and it's like Need for Speed Underground in, the, in a sort of way. But again, 70 bucks? Oh lordy. This game will be five bucks in a, in a year. Don't you worry. Boredom, boredom, boredom. Yeah. Damn. People, uh, you know, I was bringing up Ubisoft even as a live service publisher. Like, uh, the crew, Motorfest has been supported well. Rogers Republic has been supported well. Siege, For Honor. I don't know how many See? players the crew, or the crew Motorfest or whatever, but. Yeah, Crew Murder Fest was actually like one of my favorite games I played last year. All right, so right, now I gotta go, I gotta go is... back and turn in all this crap. Um, <laughs> sure, yeah. Maybe this is uh, this is the shape of my boat, but I feel more like a duck than anything else. Uh, yeah. What is this? Nice contract duck. failed. Oh, what'd you do? I don't know. I guess I didn't kill a thing fast enough. Apparently not. Da -da -da. Something's still attacking us. I still have like battle music going. No, I don't think they got the oh, memo. Oh, well, we were right next to a French fort. That's why. <laughs> oh, it's always the French, isn't it? Being dramatic. <laughs> yeah, them and their forts. They put them everywhere. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Ubisoft never letting their games go for five bucks. You're kidding, man. What? They're, they're are, like, like one of the fastest the ones. In, yeah, they're one of the fastest ones to get like. They have seventy percent markoffs minimum. Yeah, the only the only publisher that doesn't do that is Activision. You still can't and buy Nintendo. Call of Duty. Modern, you can still buy Call of Duty Modern Warfare Two from two thousand whenever it came out for fifty bucks. Yeah, it's ridiculous. Black, Black Ops never goes under thirty. What was that? I just saw a, a oh, that's not a body. I don't know what that is. What? What? There's like <laughs> a, a floating thing in the sky. Oh, I'm just seeing things now. We have arrived, the Saint Anne. What do you look like? I found Rod Juju. Are you on land? Yeah, I'm right. here. So I don't see you anywhere. A loading screen, of course, but oh. I'm here. <laughs> yeah, get a faster processor, jeez. Yeah, that's what it is. <laughs> One more A. <laughs>
For every loading screen I get, I'm taking off an A. <laughs> it's a cinema sense style of counting. People really don't like Ubisoft. I can take them and leave them. To me, I feel like you'll you can appreciate Ubisoft more if you don't play every game when it's released. But even then, I still know what people are getting at. All right, where am I? Uh, piracy is more fun with friends. Hey. Uh, you can access this menu by pressing Y. Okay. And then what? Who the hell is Rod Juju? Oh, I don't know. There's some random dude in the, in the world. Oh, nice. You completed the thing. Good job. Where are you? What happened to me clothes? I, I looked so dapper until I don't. You didn't get put on clothes yet? Apparently not. Where are their dialogue options? I don't know. <laughs> That's good. Ubisoft is the nickelback of games. That's pretty good. They didn't used to be. That's the annoying part. Like, if they'd stop chasing yeah, all those live yeah. service trends, like, they put out... I used to be really excited for Ubisoft games. Like, mm -hmm. all the Assassin's Creed games, love those. Splinter Cell, all that, all that. Like, one of their story games used to be really good. A high seas heist. All right. There's the cookery. There's the thing. Provisions. Driftwood. Uh, old email. No. Leave me alone. Look at I'm going after a convoy now. Captain's emote. <laughs> hmm. I think it's more so. Once you do well, people just have a hard time accepting what you do. So, like, Todd Howard. <laughs> because if that was just any other random game, it's like, eh, it's whatever. But since it's Bethesda's of all places, <laughs> like, you're not allowed to fail at all. All right. Oh. Still tracking that ship or what? How do I change my clothes? The uh, the vanity. Oh, there you are. What's up? You found me? Where are you? Yeah, behind you. Can I crouch? Of course not. You have to pay money for that. I am uh, cutscene looking. I can interact with you. P remove from I group. Curse you. To you. <laughs> no. We can trade. We can trade items in the game. And mutiny. Yeah. Would you like to trade some acacia? <laughs> what? The wood. We we don't have items. What are we trading? Rum. Oh, no, that's all mine. Hold on, I'm getting dressed. What a B. All right. Oh, my God. One loading screen into another beauty. What happened to my loot? I had loot before. Oh, that I... That I is it not in my... Okay, okay. Purchase and equip. Change physical appearance. My clothes, girl. I'm going to find some Oroko planks. What would you need to crouch for, next gen? There's nothing to crouch for. There's no stealth. <laughs> no ledge grabbing? What the hell? <laughs> yeah. Can't throw a fireball. Can't do nothing in this game. Can't do nothing. Do I have a, ooh, I have a new cannon. Equipment. Nice. All right, let's use some of this. To, oh, is this racist? <laughs> I'm not wearing that. You can't make me. <laughs> <laughs> uh, let's see here. I got, some, I got some new cannons. Which one of you looks most like what I'm wearing well, I got new furniture, oh. too. Oh, that is stellar. I'm like a peacock out here. We're like Mr. Shmee from Peter Pan? Okay. Increases accelerate. I'll wear that. Give me that. Okay. Furniture slot two. You have to buy it? Oh, I'd, I'd sooner be naked. <laughs> yeah, you know what? Close enough. Wait. The Captain Jack. Just the hat. Boy. Ship cosmetics. Ooh, I can get new sails. All right. Ah, let me out. Cool. Steering wheel. New sails. Sick. <laughs> uh, as the resident survival crafter enjoyed, does this game feel like one almost? No, really. No, it feels closer to, like I said, like an MMO. Closest game I've played in recent memory that reminds me of this is Dredge. 
because of this. You know, go around, go to this area, get this loot, play a little mini game for it. But Dredge had more, uh, I guess, a, a more solid uh, substance of just like, this is what you're doing. You're getting fish. Why? Because they're weird. <laughs> yeah, because they're weird. Get that fish. Because they look funny. All right, we're heading out. I'm yeah, bark. I'm updating on my crew stuff. Oh, I have a lemur. Oh. Repair this goddamn ship. Nice. Manage the ship. Manage my expectations. Going up what? Oh, my god, way. Okay. Wait, oh, wait there's armor. Is. Oh, there's the cat. I was looking for it. What? This is the one that came with the game. Give Shit. It. Nope. Give it I need here. to repair. But I need to repair. Hold on. I'm not. I'm not embark disembarking yet. I gotta repair my ship. Enjoy. What's the name of your boat, anyhow? That's a good question. Let's find. I don't remember. I think. It's... How can I see? Ship. Uh. A consumer report? Well, that's kind of what bite size and well, not really. That's what, you know, Yahtzee does that. I'm going to review this game. It'll be a fun time. Okay, so I need to go all the way to the Angaya coast to get the loot that I need to make the next <laughs> size ship up. Mm -hmm. mm. So we're going from here, we're going right. Ah, that's funny. Dredge was a Lovecraft in game. Hey, hey. Mm -mm. There you are. Look at my, look at my ship is all decked out with stuff now. <clears throat> What'd you name it? Uh, Beater Rammer? That's it. I don't, I don't think I gave my ship a name yet. I don't plan uh, on keeping this ship. Lame. I kept mine. I named it Ye Old McRib. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the terror of the high seas <laughs> and your bowels. Yeah, I was going to say the McRib, the terror of your ass. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, that's cool. Look at that. There's a there's a code for dredge right there. A little Lovecraftian fish them up. Good stuff. Lemur. I stare at you forever. Nice. What's the mission? What are we doing? Or, uh, yeah, I'm going a gatherer? To get, yeah, I'm, we're going to go get loot because then we can upgrade or get to the next ship size up. Nice, nice, nice. I do like making boat bigger. This is, uh, really, it's just Monster Hunter for boat people. Oh, shoot. That, you know what? <laughs> that sounds like your video title. Just. <laughs> Monster Hunter for yeah, that, that, that's just gonna yeah, that's just gonna insult everybody. Good. <laughs> All at once. <laughs> On me way. How do you tell the wind direction? You but your, your, your crew your crew it. automatically changes the sails for you. Yep. Yep. Who are worse, boat people or car people? I don't know. I'd say a boat person out here is more annoying because we don't have any water nearby. So I'm like, bro, why? Yeah. We're landlocked. Mm. Do I underestimate the draw of the ship combat? Sure, yeah. Again, I, uh, when it, whenever it's an early impressions, I just kind of say things and it's not till way later when I get proper opinions formed out right yeah. now it's very just you know very, go here gather this go here go it's another uh, for me like the appeal is, is another turn your brain off and just play a game yeah but like there's other ones you can get for cheaper yeah yeah but the ship combat is at least different <laughs> if that's all we want the, the lobotomies go for like five bucks Ooh, he's got get the wood I need. A, this, I'm killing like this ten, guy. ten bucks, you can get yourself a, a Big Mac with a combo and lobotomize yourself with a straw. I, I just oh, I tweeted out a new metal straw that you can get now for that, too. What? For the Big yeah. Mac? Yeah, you eat a, eat a Big Mac through a metal straw. Beauty. About time. Don't need that. Dun, 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 dun. Honestly, the only reason I'm not like 
dogging too much on this game. It's, it's just funny to see the looter shooter style on a boat. <laughs> <laughs> That's the novelty it has right now. Where it's just like, ooh, purple loot. But it, it's it's like ore, but on the water. Yeah. It's rum, you know. It's following a it's established template, for sure. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, that's how you can tell where the wind's coming from. What? It's on your little compass. The yeah, thing that says right. like five knots. Yeah, that little. All you all you can do is align it. Like a real boat. Big Mac combo in Japan is like seven bucks. Dang. Crazy. Okay, so there's gonna be some stuff in front of us that we need. We need bronze, loot, fine jute. Right. Hmm. This guy's got more of that. What's the difference between green rum and blue rum? Ah, oh, you're like 2% to your stamina. You know. <laughs> yeah. It's incremental. <laughs> loot goblins do love their pretty coats. Yeah, see, so you get to be a, a seafaring loot goblin now. Who's that guy? What do you do? I'm getting right here, He's right. got the materials I want. Ah. Bam. Knocked him. Crit. So there actually is a uh, Boredom. some small oh. some small details uh, for like bracing, where I think uh, Black Flag used to like there was like a camera effect or something that you would have to know if they were gonna shoot at you to brace. Yeah. In this one, like you gotta look at the sh you gotta keep your eye on the ship because you'll see the cannon doors open. That's when you know when to brace. That's a neat little detail. Uh, a little bit, a little bit more. The park and break down. Yeah. Uh, I only, I only uh, just uh, noticed that. A little more skill, he says. You're really digging for it. <laughs> <laughs> it's here somewhere, damn it. <laughs> it's gotta got, be. He's got the planks I need. I wonder if this guy now. So what? Uh, you, you ever, after you shoot a ship, you just like telescope another ship and see if they got what you want. Yep. And I can just see, I can, my, my telescope is 3D. Oh. Uh-oh. Pissed off a few ships. We got big Yeah, cans. maybe, maybe don't fight them in the port. Oh. I feel like we should pull them out this way. What's this long shot right here? I said, oh, I whiffed everything. Okay, these cannons sound more powerful. These long shot cannons, they'll sound better. <laughs> Yeah, people were complaining. People were clowning on the sounds. This Ow! Ah, got him. Board him, and Captain. Board him. Boom! I missed. God, boarding him. What? You know, I just shoot him. <laughs> <laughs> no. Okay. So I do. You do need to board him if I want the more specific loot. Yes. Yes. Yes, sir. Eric, Eric and Pin a message, I believe, to say we're aware of the audio. Yes, it's not on our end, it's the game zone, the audio glitches. Yeah. Patrice Desolet could have saved this game. Probably not. No, he's, off, he's off making. He made that Ancestors game. Yep, he's working on uh, Anno 1667, I believe. I hope. What? Why not? Patrice? I wish. He made, God of, he made the Assassin's Creed. <laughs> yeah. And his follow-up uh, was like this very Assassin's Creed-esque game, but it would be in... Um, yeah, that's Ancestors. Amsterdam. Oh, no, Amsterdam. Oh, Amsterdam. Amsterdam. We never made it. Yeah. We no, he, he didn't get cancelled. He got robbed by TH Nordic, I believe. Oh, kill all enemies? Okay. Dun, 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 dun. Here we get... Wait. Who are these people? Oh, God. oh dear God. There we go, there's the custom recording. I have started a war. Leave More menus, yay. Dear started. God. Yep. 
trying to swim out of bounds. Oh no, don't do that to me. Uh, yeah, no, we, no, got no. Snow, we got snow this snow this morning, uh, Damien Glenn. Which I was very nice. surprised by. I did not realize we were getting snow today. I was like, what? <laughs> ah, I'm trying to return to the zone game. I'm going. It's gonna ram me. Oh, oh you're trying to get in here? Oh, okay. We're shooting yeah, in here. I know, that's where we wanna be. We get good Go loot. All I'm picking up are rusty nails. <laughs> Broken planks are oh, my favorite, how'd you know? Bam. Crit hit. See, there's just something satisfying about hitting your shot on the back of a dude's explosive barrels. I don't know what it is. <laughs> uh, no, you get you get more loot for uh, boarding a ship during fall. Do you think they port this to mobile? Probably. I feel like it wouldn't be too hard. <laughs> we are coming to take over Citrana. We are breaking the towers now. Here we go, shoot Launch the, down. the missiles! Oh no! I am like crashing! Alright. <laughs> Oh, I'm way too yeah, close maybe, to this. You know what? Maybe I don't want to sit still on this. <laughs> Those cannons yeah, are hurting no, me. You got you to gotta move, but... <laughs> well, I got my long cannons. I thought I was far enough away. Oh, there's, a, there's another there's a tower behind us. <laughs> there we go. Bop, bop. Dang, that is tanky. You know what? I have health packs. I'll just tank it. Uh, it, they they take time to recharge after you use like two of them. <laughs> yeah, yeah they do. <laughs> Ow! Stop it! <laughs> so this is your guys' fault. You keep asking for good graphics. Look at this. I would take half the RuneScape graphics with as much depth. That's a lie. <laughs> Help me take down this tower behind over here, because if we shoot them together... Which one? I've them. almost finished this one. Where'd you go? Oh, have what? Yeah. Oh, man. Good man, good man. It's all gone down the toilet since Ubisoft changed their logo to that swirling poo you got. Oh, he returned fire. <laughs> he found me. <laughs> <laughs> what, he wasn't shooting you before? No, he wasn't. <laughs> I think they were both shooting you. <laughs> bum, 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 bum. Boom. Uh, Hit a weak point good. with the long cannon. He's almost dead. Uh, Dice Awards were last night. We were going to, uh, and then Marty uh, had to go out of town this week for something that wasn't expected. Nice. And then the Dice Awards aren't until like 10 o'clock our time. Yeah. We already streamed for four hours yesterday. But we are going to do the spawnies this week. So. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yep, this is this one to shoot and we get the, we get the loot. It's almost, almost uh. done. Oh, my bum. Stop shooting that. <laughs> it is so funny to me that all the boats just carry explosive things on their bum. And you get to shoot them conveniently. Yes. Get it. There it goes. Hey, we did it. Nice. All right, now this, this bar at the top goes, and then we get loot. And I think there's going to be Wait, more ships spawning in. At the bar at the top, like every every... Yeah. 20 seconds or whatever to get more of the comes in. I think you can oh, keep you can keep shooting the uh, the houses and stuff on the on the port too. Sure, but I'm not a monster. Uh, well, race, race car lock five dollars. Here's a line for you, Frost. I'd give this an autopsy, but that would imply it was ever alive to begin with. Ooh. <laughs> oh, oh. Well, right still you could still do a dissection. Uh, enemy. Enemy has arrived to try and take the salute. Those long cannons are actually pretty satisfying. I like them, man. Yeah. Have you got the long cannons yet, or? 
Is that not the ones on the front? No, no. I've got two new cannons on the side of my ship that are like these oh. much more powerful long cannons. Nice. Uh, I, I like uh, how the guns are like directional. Uh, got the ones on the front and on the side. You can take some good shots. Why is that here? Bam. Got him. What? He's still alive. Gotcha. Oh, there's another one coming. Two of them? Nice. Oh, it's loot over there. Nah, they don't want to notice. Okay, I need one more plank and one more jute, and then I can get my big ship. Oh? What is that? There's a ship coming up behind us. Huh? Oh, over here. Oh, yeah. You can come get some. Good boy. Right there, right there. Yeah! See what I mean? Big red number instead of a little white one? <laughs> oh, my monkey brain goes oot. See, I got a bunch of I got a bunch of gray numbers. I'm doing toe shots. I know not to do toe that. Toe shots. <laughs> no. Ever shot the toe of a boat before? Boom! Big red. More. Brain says more. Ooh, this long cannon is right on his uh, sails. I think I might just stop. I, just, uh, I think I just. Yeah, you did. You're like, if nothing else, we should just come. Like, no one's allowed to use these numbers anymore. It's, Numbers are OP. What numbers? Just numbers and looter shooters. Oh. Yeah, no more numbers in games, just truths. They're, they're too good. <laughs> I got uh, one more coming through. Oh, please stop. Uh, I think I got everything. Oh, I got everything I need, so when we're done with this, we can go build my big ship. Yeah. See, you say Yahtzee would laugh at this game, but you forget. He's the most uh, navally invested. He likes boats. But would he like this boat? Probably not. He doesn't. He wouldn't get to show off and, like, you know, scream for directions on the starboard in <laughs> yeah. the port because it's. You know, yes. There's no need for any of that. Ship is all the way over on the back of the island. On me, we. I do like that you can like keep shooting the port and blowing that up. Alright. There he is. Huh? He's so tiny. Oh, I don't <laughs> the, the long cannon is the first time ah. that I've felt like satisfied by shooting something in this game. <laughs> See, maybe the guns get better as you go on. This well, they do. They did. You get you get mortars and all kinds of stuff. Like the, the, the one thing that like people are not disappointed with in this game is like the amount of ship customization and stuff you can unlock for them. I stepped out of bounds, Captain. I'm a very lawful pirate. <laughs> Island. Yep, those are called uh, breaks around here. Yeah. Oh, cool. Uh, nice. There. Plunder completed. Ah. Uh, that's a lot. Yeah, now see that. That's where I'm like, okay. For those people who do like their their like boat simulators, it's just not that. There's not that depth that I feel they'd want. Of like, where's my key to adjust the sails, and you know, how do I get the guy that moves the rudder and whatnot, yeah. steer about? That's well, uh, clearly, clearly not that. That's uh, way more casual than that, which kind of, maybe that's part of why I'm not so thrown off by it, because I go, yes, I would be, oh, uh, yeah, I that wasn't... boat would would have sunk by now if I had to be that uh, good at it. Okay, we're not going to be... Arcady, there you go. Yeah, Arcady's nice. We're going to sail back so that we can upgrade ship, and then we'll go do the heist. Gotcha. Cutscene. Nice.
I'm with Garg. Oh yeah, I like me an arcadey fishing game. Let me see under the water, bro. And there's a route through the island over here. But, uh, eh. I don't know. I can start. I'm starting oh, to see man. the the appeal of this. Like, I'm definitely like just kind of zoning and playing. <laughs> Feel like you've been burned by high prestige games. <laughs> No, because like, give me well, I can clear my brain off. Yeah, that, I mean that's fair. Because uh, like we were talking about Banishers, Ghost of New Eden last night. And, like I'm trying to get hooked into it, and I just yeah, I mean, haven't yet. Yeah, your your brain craves to be turned off for a bit. Yeah, well, you know, after long day of work and editing or all that stuff, like nice mm -hmm. to just sit down and enjoy the scene. <laughs> that's how I felt after what was it like. Especially if you're reviewing a game or something, to be in the conversation afterwards, it's like, I want to play games, but I don't want to think about them. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, yeah? Oh. Yeah. <laughs> that was my Freaking long board you, bro. Oh, I missed. Oh, God. I'm going to crash. What is this place? Palisade Bay. Oh no. There's another, another plunder thing. Oh, okay. Well, actually, I think we can. I think we can land there and trade, or we can plunder it. Hmm. Who is that? Like I, yeah, I keep going back and forth. Like, would I, would I want a game where I can explore all these islands on foot, or would they just be empty? Well, you'd want it done well, surely. Yeah, but I mean, like that—that's like a whole extra. That's like a quintuple A game at that point. Yeah, but that's also why, like, even though Black Flags, like, I loved the boats. I didn't, I didn't really care to explore the islands that much. Yeah, I, I, I felt like they, they were very just Ubisoft islands. Yeah, well, that's kind of what I was thinking too. Is like I didn't. Mm. I remember spending a lot of time on the boat, but whenever you went to an island, it wasn't like that interesting. Yeah, no grand I, adventure I think, I think or like, anything. Yeah, I think people's like maybe a bit rosy-eyed about like how good Black Flag was, even though you could get off the ship. Like, I definitely want boarding hand-to-hand -hand combat. Yeah. I definitely want that. I don't know if I care so much about being able to just explore the islands. I don't know what we got here. Barum 98, 99, 99. Admiral Nelson says a ship's a fool to fight a fort, but you all seem to make it work. Keep adjusting your sails to a second wind. Thank you, <laughs> thank you. Thank you so much. First super on a live stream. Appreciate you. Uh, 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 but, uh... Yeah, it's like, like this is the star for the what is it? <laughs> yeah, star filled but wet. <laughs> and see if Thieves like does it does the exploration kind of well, but like even even that game doesn't do like I don't know. Going to the islands is fun for like a mission objective, but that's about it. Yeah, Yarfield. <laughs> yeah, I don't I don't know. Like yeah, I'm like really torn on like what I would actually want more of from this game, and I, I it's kind of hard to answer that. I just wait to the 60 hour mark, you'll know. <laughs> if I put 60 hours into it. Oh. Alright, well now we're gonna get a big ship though. I'm getting a cutter ship now. Ship type support? Boo! I don't want some... Shit! I need a buccaneer ship! Oh man, this guy. Specialize in aiding friendly ships. I don't like to aid, I want to blow Ooh, a tank. Ew. Gonna call it Moist Starfield for now. Ugh. Oh, I have to go find. We have to go find the blueprint. Perch bills are from the Pharaoh Warrior in Sacred Tree or found on the Red Isle. Uh, it was the pirate game where the dog peed on you. That was uh, Sea of Thieves, no? Hmm? Yeah, the dog did pee on me in Sea of Thieves. Hey, and I shot out of a cannon. He shot him out of a cannon. There's a treasure <laughs> map on me back. Oh my god. It's just like Waterworld. Alright. What is that thing? 
Yeah, so I'm going through this. Like, yeah, you gotta find. Like, I, that, that is an interesting part of the game is you can't just grab the stuff that you want. So there is a progression loop of finding the blueprints, which make you explore. Sure. And you, I mean, you have to go purchase them, but you at least have to go to the place to go get it. Ah, what happened? Is this, is this not like Sea of Thieves, though? Uh, this is, well, the adding stuff to your ship? Yeah, you don't find cannons or anything out in the sea. Mm. What's this thing? Bounty board, eh? Does. Fangs of the Farah. Bombard. Long gun. Okay, let's try the blacksmith. Pirates maybe. didn't actually board and kill. Yeah, it's going almost for that. Who cares that if they didn't gentlemanly? <laughs> they went for like, like the gentlemanly pirate kind of way instead of the scallywag. Yeah. Oh, playing too nice. What we got here. All right. So there, yeah, there's all these. Yeah. So I have like the weakest cannon. There's enhanced culvern camera cannons. Fires deadly shrapnel. There's a lot of cannons. Let's see what I got here. Bah. Buy and sell. Yo. Uh, what the hell is that? Raw fiber. What do I need with this stuff for? I don't know, man. Take it. Take these rusty nails. Okay, so I got more. I got new armor blueprint. Is that how you say company or spell it? I don't think so. Okay, so now I can get new cannons. Nice, nice. Yeah, this is very much like Pirate's Code kind of captain. Okay, so see what the ship right offers me. What's up, bud? Holy crap! I would like there's, a bigger actually, boat. There's actually a shit ton of guns. I thought there was only one. Yeah. There's all deck weapons, but then there's like four different categories of weapons. Mm -hmm. Torpedo. Oh. Be a submarine. Would you? Balance. Oh, look at that. Okay, so Do not own the required one. blueprint. Oh. This That's will be given out as a contract reward. See. Someone already is just having the time of their life trying to get the pyromaniac, <laughs> trying to get the biggest cannons, and then they're going to go dick on somebody in PvP. <laughs> and that's it. That's all they could ever ask for. This is definitely, well, kind of a dad game. Okay, so I got a better cannon for my ship. You gotta get a better pickaxe so that you can get better mining stuff and you can be, oh my goodness. Oh, so many pieces to upgrade. This is a huge, this is an incremental game. That's crazy. Maybe we can do business again, or not. There's like an hmm. eavesdrop thing here. Oh, I can blow right. them. Hmm. Oh, an investigation. Freeman's lost treasure. Okay. Yeah, I knew it. Scallywags were actual pirates, and the classy ones were the privateers. Yeah, I feel more of a privateer. Hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh, Alright, have you upgraded your cannons or anything? Were you able to? I've got a better hat. My game. I got it's stuck. Nice. <laughs> oh. The, what is it? Yeah. Point forward. Oh. Hey, look at him. Yep. He washed his hair twice. In <laughs> one week. Uh, do I want that ship or do I want to save my stuff for... The blaster. You would download a boat, would you? Bad. Fuck it. Let's try a new <laughs> boat. <laughs> there. Okay. Okay. Yeah. 
Hmm. All right, let's go do this heist. Sweet. Just like in Fast and Furious. Let's go. Oh my god, we run so stupid. <laughs> Great. <laughs> uh, everyone's Captain Jack. What was that like Disney pirating game with Captain Jack in it? I forgot what it was called. It's like before the internet was real. Set sail. Oh, I forgot to repair it. Cauldrons. Remember the hit movie Hook? That was so good. It's great with that. Uh, what is his name? Robin Williams, little, little uh, hook. Him, he was there. Ah! What was Captain! That? <laughs> I've crashed again. Stop it. <laughs> what the hell is happening? Okay, that was weird. Aha, I put my my iron armor on now. Let's go. I follow you. Okay. Where we go? We go, Captain. My big new ship. Uh we're gonna go to here. Hmm. Blue marker. Uh, no. No, 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 no. Oh, bastard. <laughs> What'd you do? I disembarked. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> see you there. Oh, good. <laughs> yeah, see you there. <laughs> uh, which second wind people are going to release videos on this game? Uh, I think Frost is. Frost wants to do a cold take on oh, yeah. it. Yeah. Review. This will be lovely. And then, uh... Multiplayer only, isn't it? Yes. Um, I mean, it's it's, it's a shared like world, so it's single player. Yeah. yeah. What you got for me? Somebody Can was like, you know what? Let's make it so everyone has to single player together. <laughs> <laughs> Try my new cannons. Long range cannon is satisfying as hell to shoot. Give it that. Ooh, wait a second. Alright, yeah, here we go. On me way. Da -da 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 -da. Oh my god, not again, not again, not again. I didn't need that part of my boat anyways. <laughs> what is this? Soup? Soup on the boat. Oh, that's cool. That's cool. Ow. On the way. Mm -hmm. Guesses on how long it'll take for this to be cancelled. Every live service game doesn't need to be the most popular game. All it needs is that minimum I, I think amount of whales. Gonna, I, don't know. I think this game's gonna find its audience. I actually do. I don't know, man. It's, it's got pirate competition. From who? Sea of Thieves. So the sea of Thieves right now is only on two platforms. What are those? Xbox and PC. Just like this one. Yeah. Now it's on PlayStation, Xbox, PC. Are PlayStationers like the... Are they Are they the piratey crowd? They don't strike don't me like the types. Oh, I'm, dear start, God. I'm starting to see the appeal of this. Did you shoot another ship? Me. <laughs> and, then, and then his big brother yelled at me. Oh God, he's coming. I don't. Me. I don't think the audience for this and see if these are the same. Believe it or not. Sure. I think this game is. This game is much more casual than I would say. See if these is. <laughs> much, much, <laughs> much less investment to play. Okay. Ow. A week, Captain. Love it. Are we supposed to break all this stuff in here? What, that tower? Yeah. You can. Are we supposed to? What's the objective? <laughs> I almost knocked you over with my ship. <laughs> Jesus. 
So. No, you, you start. You started it. You finished it. <laughs> this guy, nah, he was just a side thing, you know. Fine. I missed everything. <laughs> Start green with the two poundos. So fun ship combat with a boring resource gatherer. I'm start. I'm starting to find the appeal of the game. I, I still. Uh, I, it's kind of like it's. It's kind of like Suicide, yeah, Suicide Squad to me. Like the ship combat's fun enough that I wouldn't have an issue playing this for a few hours and just shooting some stuff. And, Trying to upgrade my ship. <laughs> this is what Baldur's Gate 3 does to a man. <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> <laughs> Anything but going back to Baldur's Gate 3 at this point. <laughs> I need to find oh, is it? <laughs> yeah, exactly. But instead of that, we're playing Suicide Squad and Skull and Bones. <laughs> <laughs> me, no, me no brain, brain, me color items and shoot things. Exactly. You know, I any game that lets me eat crayons, I'm so down right now. I'm in the mood. It's all about context. I don't think this game's done anything that's remotely criminal outside of charging what it did. Yeah, I wonder how it would have gone over if this was free to play. Oh. It doesn't feel like a $70 premium game to me. I, I give you that. Yeah. This is free to play? Yeah. Game of the game of the hour. What are you doing? <laughs> trying to swerve. You're trying to push me into the island. <laughs> it's... Mm -hmm. Back, I back you up, Captain. We're going for the heist. Let's go. Yeah, what are we? Some kind of skull and bone squad? Uh, uh, yes, I'm in Act Three of Baldur's Gate Three, and I just haven't finished it. Hold up. Why is this skull and bones? Is that not redundant? Is a skull not a bone? It's just bone and bone. Double boner. Don't ask questions you don't need the answer to. Is a is a skull not a bone? Do you? <laughs> I don't. Know. I, well, I, I mean, just, you have your leg. Would I win? Would I lose it, Jeopardy? You, you don't know? call it your skull bone. I don't know. Because it has a proper name. Well, I've oh. caught the wind. I'm moving fast on this ship. Yeah. Skull is a muscle. <laughs> Yeah, there's a, it's a shower thought. <clears throat> it's the skull of bone. It's an assembly. Oh, God, this shit is hard to turn. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's why you don't travel at full speed. Just go out I'm like not, the I'm, mid one. I'm not. I just caught the wind. Uh, this the boat's got three settings. Anchor, half-mast, full-mast, reckless. <laughs> Four settings. Okay. Well, it's got ludicrous speed. <laughs> this is also like, yeah, we're, we've only explored a very tiny portion of this map. This map's huge. Mm -hmm. it's way up here. Wonder if this is modeled after anything. What do you mean? Uh, like uh, in Black Flags, they were definitely on the Caribbean. And, yeah, this is and the Indian the Ocean. Coast. Oh, cool. I like that. The skull is made of many bones. Oh no. <laughs> so bones and bones. Uh, oh, she sways. Oh, she goes. Uh, oh. Okay, bunch of random thingies here. Do you think the maybe the real issue is the year this released? Because if this had released hot off the tails of Black Flag, maybe they'd have been more crazy uh, I, for it. I, I, I honestly think it's just un unmanaged expectations for this game that it's not Black Flag 2.0. Sure. People want Black yeah. Flag 2.0. Yeah, and it's right. just not that. Sure, sure. But I mean, even then, like the graphics look a little closer to that game than nowadays. Yeah, yeah. yeah. it's a little 
Yeah. Uh, the Ubisoft character models never look good, so. <laughs> That's fair. Uh, I'll give you that. Yeah, uh, no. the, the His water... islands look a little weird, too. Are they? Uh, they look fine to me. Ooh. I mean, we're fighting a big ship out. Oh, I'd almost say go, go. Oh, nice. Go, go and play Black Flags again, and do, just walk through the island, and then just compare. I'm coming. In. I'm only bringing up Black Flags because it's one of the you know, like three pirate games I know. Yeah. It just happens to be Ubisoft. Uh, is it? Does he says is it unmanaged expectations or did they set expectations that were met? They they've literally showed the game off so many times now. Like if you didn't know what it was, then you didn't look at any of the marketing. <laughs> it's me. Yeah. yeah. I got here. I said with the five pound love the tricorn, Mr. Ruiz, love from England. Oh, thank you, thank you. That ship looks scary. Probably shouldn't attack that one. <laughs> See, this would have been such a cool like tack on. Little little black flags DLC of like, hey, now it's just open world combat. Yeah, you know. <laughs> I mean, you got this version of the game. The version that you could have got was just straight PvP. So take that as you will. Yeah. Maybe that's where they're figuring out. If you're gonna live service things, make it PVE. Because <laughs> if it's purely PvP, yeah, you probably you'd just die sooner. There's the shanties. Oh, so if you feed people, you get like. Uh, it's right on yeah. the D pad, you get buffs. Yeah. Your stamina regen, efficiency, and all that okay, good stuff. Okay, well, I guess we're attacking a big ship, so. <laughs> on the way, Captain. He's only a level four. We can handle this. This is where we sink and die. Oh yeah, we're definitely gonna die, but you know, it'll be fun <laughs> dying. Oh, he ain't that big. He just looked big. He's just got a lot of sails. <laughs> that means he can have more cannons. Oh, that's a big boy. Which one yeah. are you attacking? Hopefully not the red one. Oh. Okay. Uh, no, no, the one with There's the marker mark above him. Yeah. Did you mark that, or was that there? Damn, he's fast. <laughs> okay. He uses we never catch him. This is the ship. ship. We're heisting it. Damn. Oh, why did you shoot him so long? Like so far away. Well, because I got long oh, he's... cannons. Yeah, but he's just booked it. We'll get him. Oh, we're, we're never gonna see him again. Okay. Oh. He's turning. Yeah. Get the chain shot. Hit him in the brakes. Ooh. The wind is carrying us, Capitan. Nice. The wind oh line. boy, he just let us into a trap with mortars. Uh oh. What's this wee nonsense? I'm so far behind. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy, right. this is turning into a big battle. Oh damn, that's kind of cool. See, look at that. Our first he, ambush. He, he tricked me. <laughs> that's funny. This is just like the intro. Oh, boy. Shoot out his crow's nest. I whiffed. I am coming after him, Capitan. Got him. Oh, dear God. <laughs> you just murdered that ship and yourself. I did. Dear. No, that barely did anything to me. Got him again. See? Ooh, big red numbers, baby. I'm, a, I'm alive. Boom, fire the Zim muskets? Sure. Let him have it. Crew attack for 4,000? Ho oh, ho, 4,000 what, you might ask? Oh, that's not good. Sing a shanty while we kick his ass. <laughs> Ow, those mortars hurt bad. <laughs> oh, God, get out the way, get out the way, get out the way. Nice. I'm on his ass. Let's try to make a run for it. Damn. Alright, this is the first time like I've actually Where really enjoyed the wind. this game for a second. <laughs> this is just the intro again. There we go, Captain. Oh, nice. Nope, just shoot him. Just shoot him. Nice. Cool. 
Uh, I'm humping your ship. <laughs> right in front of him, too. <laughs> yeah. Just like? celebrating. Oh, star charts and stuff. Right. That was a fun death. What is everyone doing here? Oh. If I must kill you, I will, I guess. So much looting. Does this classify as a looter shooter? I get looter shooter vibes. Yeah, I would say it is, yeah. <laughs> like, this is the wettest looter shooter. Oh, the man. That's wild. Have I not beaten Baldur's Gate 3 yet? Because I got fired and there was a bunch of other games I had to try and play. And Suicide Squad. You know. <laughs> Turns out starting a business keeps you really busy. It's a looter cannon. <laughs> uh, okay. Ow. Did you shoot me again? Uh, no. Pirates to starboard or whatever. You know. Where'd that big red ship go? Off the port. Oh, God. I don't know. What's this guy go? That's another big merchant ship. Ooh, we got oh, a bunch God. of stuff. Uh, you want to shoot him so close to the port? Hell yeah. Okay. Violence. No, it doesn't, the port doesn't start unless we plunder it. I hope not. One nearby party member. Oh, look, the port's shooting us now. <laughs> uh, <laughs> it's uh, your fault. Yep. I was the one in the back. <laughs> I've oh, been well, framed. Pissed off a bunch of people. <laughs> Ooh, you let ale? Nice. There was like a lawful gauge or something, so I don't know how that works. It's like Grand Theft Auto. Uh, yeah, there is. Like if you piss off a faction enough, they'll start hunting you, I think. Oh, I bet. Got him. That's all you. Boarding. Oh, In nice. my cutscene. <laughs> <laughs> uh, he's got away. I'm not boarding him anywhere. I'm blowing him up. <laughs> what do you mean he got away? Oh, you killed him. I've been encumbered. No. My ship's too fat. Uh, okay. Quickly, you just eat ship. some of this curry. Oh, you blew up my shipwreck. Who? You. I'm in the inventory. There's no way. Uh, so I'll give you one thing. I don't know. I'm not miserable. That's the point. Yeah. Where's the red aisle at? Uh, uh, I don't know. E Royal. You can go. You want to go collect some cocoa nuts? What? The cocoa <laughs> puff bird asking me weird <laughs> questions right now. Oh, I can only swim at eight knots because I'm a little chunky, a little fat boy. Okay, so found in the red aisle. How do I drop a loot? I don't know where the red aisle is, though. Can I just, like, eat all this bread? These <laughs> send these over there. The frick are these? Let's check. Oh, dear God. I've made it heavier. Oh, no. Is Baldur's Gate 3 a must play? I'd say so. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> See, look. Look, there's Duncan right there. Holy shit, this is a Ubisoft game that actually made something that isn't mid. Like, some people are going to love this. <laughs> yeah, I don't hate it. Audience. You know? Oh, Clan of Faro. That's who I was looking for. Are these all Clan of Faro? Oh, these oh yeah, you all leave Duncan alone. This is his game of the year. Citrama. Garg says, I'm serious. Hey, enjoy what you enjoy. Don't worry about what everybody else thinks. <laughs> <laughs> I, yeah, I'm like, I'm, I'm a Feroz. I'm not hate, hating the game. I don't like the... Mm -hmm. I don't like having to go to the islands for missions and all that stuff, but... Uh, yeah. You know, like... 
At least the sailing and all that. Can't really too. complain too much about it. I think we, we need to get away from the this game is the best game or this game is the worst game if it's not. We should be okay with just going, the game is okay. <laughs> Oh, okay. I'm so bring that. So for 2024, it's the, it's the year of neutral. But you actually need to upgrade your crowbar to get it open. My crowbar. Huh. Mm -hmm. Don't know that it'll have like any cultural relevant relevance in a year or two. Eh, it's does okay. It, does it matter? As long as, it was, as long as it's the best time for the people who it's serving, like, that's all I can ask for. Like why does it? Yeah, why does the game have to have cultural relevance? Like, I don't know. I, sometimes, like, definitely, the YouTube audience expectations are much too high for games. Sometimes, <laughs> no, it's just for conversation. You know, I guess like it's hard to talk about it. Like, if, after if someone genuinely tried to talk to me about this game, I was like, eh, it's a thing. You know? Yeah, but like, I, I it's there. a lot of these large service games, and like, if you, if anybody tries to say I'm. Um, Banking on them or whatever, you can go watch my video where I completely tank on them. Whoa, but, uh, what a show! <laughs> I feel like these live service games are never aiming to be game of the year. They are aiming to no. turn off your brain, play with friends, <sighs> and that's about it. This is uh, pretty much like designed for whales, but not in a slanderous kind of oh, way. Sacred trees all the way down there. What the fuck? This is just like, hey, let's design a game for the kind of person that wants to turn their brain off. Have a good time and maybe whip out the credit card here and there. Yeah, that's uh, just where we are. Bands piece says Nick Frost. What would you need to change in the island gameplay to make it proportionally fun? Well, there isn't well, any. <laughs> yeah, um, there's well, nothing on the island. Uh, yeah, but like, see if all right, see if these has island gameplay. But I gotta be honest, like, see if these islands aren't really fun to explore. There's not like enough unique. Yeah, I'd like things. something bespoke. Yeah, like I, I want to go something like crafted. Yeah. Yeah, um, you know if I could RPG sell elements. There you go. I don't. I, yeah, I don't even know if like like I don't want to go to a city and talk to people. I just don't know. I guess just the act yeah. of discovery. But yeah, you know when we talk about like Elden Ring and all that, that game like every time you find a new location, there's unique things to do there. There's unique things to find. Yeah. Uh, um. See, that's a that's a bit cynical next gen it's the pricing point isn't trying to attract suckers it's trying to attract people of that caliber i guess of that spending caliber someone who's okay with dropping 70 bucks for this game is going to be okay with dropping another 50 for a pat a pirate hat and it's probably because they make like well i don't know eighty thousand bucks a year hundred thousand two hundred k drop in the bucket for them i don't know about that but... the amount of ceos i met that drop so much on free-to-play games is ridiculous <laughs> yeah, yeah they, they do like their free-to-play games they, they do. Yeah. Uh, I don't know. Well, even even the microtransactions like haven't been in my face yet. I'll give it that. Yeah, I had to go looking for them, or I got lost and I found yeah, them. I all guess the, all the gear. I mean, there's plenty of cosmetics you can just unlock in the game and find. Like, yeah. and, uh, it's, I don't really know what the complaints about microtransactions yet. I don't. That doesn't mean they're not there, and I don't like. I just don't know. I haven't seen them yet. Oh. Yeah. The uh, the sailing navigation, like as I go through like these passes and all that, actually is a bit more involved. Slowing your ship down, and adjusting your sails, and that kind of stuff. Dear God, seventy dollars and I can't even hit pirate booty raw pass. That's <laughs> the real. That's the real problem here. <laughs> but yeah, I, I, like the loading screens, I could do without. Like, just let me. Disembark the ship. Yeah, that, that was like, you, just it's those little details that add a lot. I think. Mm, the uh, issues there. Oh. You're like, yeah. if you're looking for passion, if you're looking for that next great high, you're not getting it here. Uh, bum, bum, bum. Ooh, Hulk for a new ship. Okay, I found the Hulk. I wonder if there's a discussion to be had about more and more games with the target audience being big spenders as an industry trend. I mean, video games are a luxury to begin with. And already, uh, for a while, it was all about sort of like just being able to afford it. But yeah, now there's going to be more luxury games. Luxury. Expensive games. I can already go and craft the, the next ship, the Hulk. The Hulk? Yeah. yeah. The Hulk? What? Is that real? Got some mortars unlocked. 
Get braced, nerd. Oh, God. I'm gonna die. Pew. All right, back to the... Uh, I, I don't have a problem playing this for another hour if you don't. I don't have a problem with the game, but I do have things to do, unfortunately. Okay. So, I will have to call it there. You're, you're calling it now? Yeah, I'll call it now. Okay. <laughs> no, no, look, I want to play another hour. <laughs> hey, look at this guy. They got him. They got him. You're gonna well, have to I just, I just got, soul searching I just got my, like, what's wrong with you? <laughs> I got my Hulk. I want to go get my Hulk. They got you. <laughs> it's why I play idle games. Where it's just like, oh, the next one. Oh, the next one. Oh, it's bigger now. <laughs> and then I'm done after like two weeks. Had a says solo second one stream. Uh, we'll we'll save it because I'm sure we'll play. The, we talked about playing this for shoot the shit next week. So maybe yeah, we'll come back and go. be farther. I'll probably play this a little bit this week and see. Yes, Cross I is going to play it more because he's going to do a cold take on it. So, you know. But I don't know. The, the, the heist mission was fun. I'll give it that. Like getting True. getting tricked into a, 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 a ambush was fun. <laughs> I'm sure as we get through with more contracts and stuff, they'll play their hand a bit more with the writing. That's <laughs> yeah. what I'm looking for. So I'm hoping anyways. Oh, uh, then I don't think I don't think there's any story worth giving a shit about in this. But <laughs> tragic. This we'll catch? see. We'll see. As far as as far as judging the game, I've only got two hours of it. Um, I'm not hating it, not loving it. In a game, and in a, in a just a, in a time where there's so many other games, it wouldn't be on the radar. Yeah. That's that's two hours for now. All right, don't hold that. Don't hold me until I have at least two hundred. Jeez. <laughs> that's a good solid. Like yeah, I've made up my mind. <laughs> Yeah. Cool. All right. Um, that's going to end this Skull and Bones launch day stream. Thanks for everybody that showed up. Plenty of you did. Uh, I've also seen a ton of you sign up for Patreon during that, uh, as we put out in the community tab. Seen our first little dip on there. We want to try and keep that Patreon above 60 k a month because that helps cover all of our salaries to keep this awesome place going for all of you. Uh, so if you haven't signed up for Patreon yet, maybe consider doing so. Even a dollar a month helps out a lot. Uh, no other streams or content today. Uh, tomorrow, brand new episode of Adventures Nigh, 11 a.m. Premiere page will be going up tonight for that, so you don't miss it. Uh, and then uh, you'll have uh, some other new stuff next week. And then uh, for us, uh, we included a, a little announcement in your stuff. What's going on with Cold Take in two weeks? Cold tag in two weeks. We're going to start ramping it up just a wee, 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 wee little bit because I've been having a lot of topics coming through. We've got a big old backlog of them, so it's going to be going to weekly. It's going to be a fun old time. Until then, go watch the, uh, the, the uh, most recent one where we actually do talk about numbers and mm -hmm. why they make my, my brain go brrr. It's great. Yeah, so after February 26th, cold take will be weekly, so you'll get this man's voice every week for you. And my new mm. show, Unpacked, uh, will have a new episode uh, next weekend, which will be all about positive multiplayer experiences. So I've been a little bit negative in the first two. We'll do something positive for the next one. There you go. What happens after you catch up? Probably, I probably won't, is the thing, because now we've got, like, the usual cold takes. We've got, uh, we've branched down to, like, design-type cold takes and also review-type cold takes. Yeah, no, I've, uh, I've been cranking. <laughs> I'm a cranker. <laughs> All right, well, you're here first. Ross is a cranker. Thanks yeah. for all the super chats. Thanks for joining Patreon. Thanks for subscribing over on Twitch. And uh, we'll see you back here uh, probably tomorrow for Adventures. Tomorrow, Day. tomorrow morning. As oh, yeah. Better with friends. Yeah, we're going to be luchadors. It's going to be a good time. Cool. All right. We'll see you all then. Bye-bye. <laughs>